guys, here we are, Old Lady Kitchen today. Uh, today I'm cooking for you. Uh, so I'm cooking cheap and easy chili con carne in the slow cooker. So um, those of you who've got a slow cooker, or if you're getting one, get the liners. So much easier, no washing up at the end. Brilliant. So, and they're, they're only cheap. So there we go. Anyway, in here I have some, I've softened off some onions. So, chopped, softened onions into the slow cooker. So now in that pan, I'm going to just cook off some uh, mince. Now I've got some cheap mince, so it was only 99p, bought it for Christmas and put it in the freezer. So that's going in the frying pan. There we go, I'm going to cook that off. So while that's browning off, I'm just browning off that mince, um, I'll tell you what else I'm going to put in it. So um, overnight I have soaked some, I've got some butter beans and cannellini beans, just a handful, just to pad it out a little bit. And I've got some um, red kidney beans to go in it. I've got a cheap tin of tomatoes, chopped tomatoes, bit of tomato puree, mild chilli powder because um, I'm making chilli but I don't like chilli. <laughs> I don't like hot chillies. I can't cope with hot so I'll do mine. But you could put in hot if you want. If you've got fresh chillies you could put some of those in. And my favourite frozen garlic. So um, that's what's going to go in it. So um, I'll get them brown off this meat now and I'll come back to you. So then, I've uh, browned off the meat, here we go. Now I've got a top tip for you. Now I used the cheaper, which is, just, this was on offer anyway, but cheaper, the 20% fat mince. Uh, because I like the flavour more. And what I do, once I've browned it off, I pour off the excess fat. So I pour it off into one of these little boys. And if you're creative and clever and things like that you could mix in some bird seed and some oats and things and make fat balls for the birds um, especially if you've got little kitty winks and that to do that so that's good for that anyway <laughs> put this let's chop, chop all this in here so there we go with our mince all browned and then basically is throw it all in so in go the tomatoes Let's have a bit of tomato puree, there we go. If you add red wine, you could put red wine in there, you could put me beans in, Ooh. beans in, oh we need a spoon for those beans, Let's get a few more beans out, kidney beans in, butter beans and cannellini beans in. Here we go with chilli, uh, chilli powder, or if you add fresh chillies, you can put fresh chillies in. Your garlic in. And I'm just going to rinse out this uh, tomato tin and put a drop of water in. Here we are, a drop of water. on to low and there we have it so we'll come back later when it's cooked and see what it's like um, I forgot to mention <laughs> I'm so used to doing it without I found out that I can have no stock cubes for me gluten free so I'm just going to put just a little bit of stock in to uh, add to the meatiness and flavour and the saltiness as well probably so because I haven't added any salt or pepper but you could add salt and pepper if you want, so I'm going to pop that in there as well. 
There we go. So when you're cooking with a slow cooker, you don't need so much fluid because it doesn't evaporate. So um, you've got, you know, be careful how much fluid you put in, otherwise you'll end up with watery sauce. Um, but anyway, we'll see how it turns out later. Catch you in a bit. Well, my lovelies, I wish you had smelly vision because I've been smelling this cooking all day and it smells lush. So I'm just about to get it out and try it. So here we go. Let's have it. Got some brown rice to go with it, keeping it healthy. Look at that. Brown rice and quinoa. Very healthy, don't you think? I'm going to give you my verdict now. Oh, if I say so myself, it's bloody gorgeous. <laughs> so there you go. Well, I'm going off to enjoy that now. So um, be good. Stay safe, everyone. And I'll catch you next time. Bye.